Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Children's Church. The Swalwicks are here. Philly baby is also here. Can you see him? Oh, there he is. Okay, let's move the camera a little bit. Okay. Today's um, Bible verse and story is, to me, I title it A Glimpse of Hope. Um, what's referenced in the story is this man who has this fig tree. And you guys love fruit, right? Okay, so if you have a fruit tree, you want it to flourish, right? And give you sweet fruit. Well, this tree is giving no fruit for three years. And he says to the gardener who takes care of it, just cut the tree down, it's wasting space. And the gardener says, let's give it another year. I'm gonna dig around, put fertilizer in. You know, fertilizer is like super food for plants. And let's see if it bears fruit. God, a good analogy is um, God wants us to bear fruit. God wants us to be fruitful and successful. When I think of fruitful with people, I think of success. And the lesson today talks about we are all rooted in God's love. When we pray, when we read our Bible, we, when we trust in the Lord, our lives will be fruitful. But if we walk away and we don't trust Jesus, we will dry up like dried fruit. And that's the analogy. The, the, the conversation is, is in, around repenting or perishing. So this time during Lent, we think, you know, when we, we are all sinners, right? We've all done something we're not super proud of. Mm -hmm. we've, we've told lies, perhaps, or cheated on a test. God forgives us for that, but he wants us to, to repent. not do it again. He want, right. He wants us to not do it again. Repent kind of means go, oh, you know, turn away from that bad stuff and go to God and look for forgiveness. So Jesus often speaks of the need to repent. This means, you know, I'm going to turn away from anything that is not godly. I ask to be brought more and more into the world of the goodness and the love, the light and the truth. So what we learned today is, you know, we have to give each other a chance, right? This fig tree to me is like, give everybody a chance. Even if we do something that's bad, it doesn't mean we're bad people. We can repent and we can be, be forgiven by God and be reborn in a way that God's grace is really there to do. So let's say a prayer together. Dear God, Dear Dear God, God thank you for your grace. Thank, thank you, you for, for our grace. Thank you for forgiving our sins. Thank you for forgiving our sins. Please help us grow in you so that we can bear fruit. Please help us grow in you so we can grow fruit. In Jesus' name we pray. In Jesus' name we pray. Thank you, church, family. We'll see you soon. Happy St. Patrick's Day. Bye. <laughs>